is thinking too much bad for you? Normally, anything done in excess is bad or harmful. However, thinking too much is beneficial. Yes, it is. Overthinking is bad when you keep adding problems to an existing problem. It saps you of your energy. Thinking is beneficial when you are thinking constructively, trying to grasp concepts or figure out how to obtain a solution for a certain problem. Thinking is a resource and we should know how to use it wisely. Now, how does the thinking process work? You, as a human being, see and feel in the direction your eyes are pointing. In the same way, you see and feel in the direction of your thoughts. You hear, see, and also taste through your thoughts. Even if your nerves sense the flavor of a certain food, if it does not get delivered to your thoughts, you cannot even taste what you are eating. If you do not think, you cannot feel it, even if you experience it. So we have to understand our body, thoughts, and brain nerves, and then do it. People act and live according to their thoughts. Therefore, you must think extremely well. Draw a clear line between what you need to abstain from and what you need to act on. Thoughts are alive, and this is why you need to control them well. You can consider the management of thoughts as bringing up a child that wants to do whatever it wants just to be comfortable and complains when it's not. You really have to raise them well. Even if it's hard, we have to train our thoughts because they are alive. They are this divine element of the physical body. Success or failure is determined by your thoughts. Thoughts make you remember. If your thoughts do not remember it, you won't know, even if you saw it. Even if you have eaten food, if your thoughts do not remember it, you won't even know that you ate. Make your thoughts sharp. Think big. Thoughts are on various different levels, and you really want to take action after thinking well. People exist in tens of thousands of divided levels because of their thoughts. People take action according to their thoughts and also receive joy or suffering because of their thoughts. Dull thoughts are like a blunt knife. Therefore, even if you try to cut off the wrong thoughts and make yourself perfect, you cannot do it sharply as with a sharp knife. Sharp thoughts are treasures. Sharp thoughts will make you succeed and prosper. If you take action with dull thoughts, nothing you do will turn out properly. If you sit still lethargically without thinking, that time is not living time. It is like the time when you're asleep. So, how to use your brain well every day? Do something new, new hobbies, experiences, learning new languages or playing chess helps stimulate the brain. Exercise regularly and practice regular memory training to make your brain work better. Eat healthy and do not smoke. Be curious and think positive. Rewire your brain. Scientists proved that if you consciously alter your thoughts through practices like mindfulness, you can make your brain shift from right side thinking to the left. You will also be less anxious, have more energy, and be happier overall. Meditate and pray. Recent studies demonstrate that meditation and prayer not only relieves stress but actually changes your brain. And the kind of mindful technique you practice affects the kind of changes your brain experiences. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to give us a like and subscribe for more health videos. See you again soon.